guys, welcome to another bucket plugin tutorial. Today it's on Battle Tracker, the plugin that does uh, two main things really. So, first of all, it can change all the death messages and make them look very, very nice. And secondly, it tracks kills, deaths, and uh, KD ratio. And you can put them on signs so people can see who's the best PvPer. And yeah, so let's go into the configs to begin with first. So, what we're going to do is um, change some of it. So, if I change the slice to. Uh, Annihilated, say annihilated like that. That will pop up. Um, let's change it here as well, just so you can see that uh, you can change as much as you like or as little as you like, just depending on what you want. And yeah, that's that um, messages file really. Uh, signs is just storing where signs are. You don't need to go into that. Config, you could use this. Um, that's just setting whether. Um, you see the various messages, so uh, you, whether it sends to bucket, whether it sends to uh, your actual self, so you can set true, false, track PVE, so that is tracking uh, the environment, so stuff like falling off cliffs, creepers, zombies, etc. And we are going to go in game now and show you all the nice commands. So there's there's not that many, but it, it is quite nice. And the signs as well. Hey guys, we're in game now and I'm going to show you the commands. So forward slash PVP is a command that shows you um, your stats. PVP top shows you the top players. Um, you can see them here. Um, it shows you kills, deaths, um, your best streak and your kill to death ratio. So when it says infinity, that means you haven't died. So yeah, it's infinity really. Uh, you can also do PvP versus uh, and then select a player like this. And it will show you um, when you actually killed them. And uh, it actually shows the date and the time. So today is Thursday, uh, surprise, surprise. And I won because I was beating Elton Jim up earlier, which is very, very fun. And there you can see uh, the annihilated um, message that we actually set in the config um, a few minutes ago. And with an axe, I'm going to show you there is another different message which we didn't edit. So cleave, that sounds pretty cool. And what we can do, we can set some signs. So if I can remember what they are. So first of all, PvP rating, like this, and it updates. Um, you can also put a third sign. So if I click this... Hopefully it should update. Um, let me just get uh, some more signs uh, like this. And you can make these as long as you like. So you can also do PvP uh, kills like this. And this should, there we go. So I've got nine kills. LC Jim's got five. Oh, it's updated. So you just right click to update and it will do it very very shortly so um there is another sign i think it's wins so pvp wins there we go um there might be another um let me, let me just check P P P pvp i don't know whether it'd be losses uh, no there isn't because uh, why would you celebrate how many times you've died um, i don't know so if i just kill lt jim here um like so um this will go up to 10 soon, uh, that will go up to 10 soon, and uh, that should change. So let me just respawn them and kill them a couple more times, and you will see that it will actually update. So, uh, just depends how long, oh look, that's updated, this is updated, and this has as well. So yeah, that is very cool. Um, you can also do for slash BT, uh, B B T, which shows you, um, some admin commands really you don't really need to be messing around with this bt help to there is a second page um but yeah it's mainly the pvp pvp commands that you need to be using so that is the end of this plugin 